So all eyes are on Khabib Nurmagomedov. Daniel, as your former teammate, makes his return to competition here tonight. A lot of us felt like this moment would not materialize. He's chasing 30-0 now. He's chasing 30-0. I mean, he's one of the only guys to get out of this thing clean. Nobody goes undefeated unless your name is Khabib Nurmagomedov. The guy has fought the best. He is a guy that lets you know what his intentions are, and he goes out there and he works the game plan. He's gonna get in your face. He's gonna try to overwhelm you with his wrestling. And you look at his boy, Hasbula in the corner. Habib Nurmagomedov looking for a big night. The Dagestani social media legend has Bula Magomedov in the corner of Habib Nurmagomedov tonight. Habib Nurmagomedov. He has graced the octagon with his mind set on one thing tonight, that UFC championship belt. Fighters expeditiously rise to mixed martial arts superstardom. But how about Alex Pereira? Crosses over into mixed martial arts from kickboxing and essentially takes the sport by storm? By storm, John. I mean, so fast to go from a guy that was what can be to the champion. But when you possess this level of skill, when your kickboxing is second to none, and then you train with Glover and you develop wrestling defense, you know that you have a chance. Pajeda not only had a chance, he took it all the way to the title. And tonight, he looks to get another victory. He's seemingly a perfect mix of intensity and composure. He has heart, championship medal, Alex Pereira, the total package. We're certainly glad he's here in the UFC. the tape for this heavyweight championship fight. We set it inside the octagon. Here's Bruce Buff. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. <laughs> for this one. All right, here we go with round one action. We'll see how Alex Pereira chooses to proceed. He is going to have the striking advantage against most of the men in this division, and that is likely how he's going to choose to attack tonight. Leg kicks are truly the stuff of legend, and he doesn't throw it full force, just touching that lead leg, and oftentimes all it takes is one to change the complexion of the entire fight. 
right, so perhaps a harbinger of things to come as the kickboxer stays upright, successfully defends the first takedown attempt by the rest. Defending the first takedown, but he's got more coming in his direction. He's got to do exactly what he did. He needs to press pause, repeat, pause, repeat, making sure that he does the same exact thing every single time that allows for him to stay up. But it is punched to the body, rejected there by the defense. Nice job by the opponent. job at least staying upright on that. Yamago Medoff's bleeding from the mouth now. A cut there on his lip. That doesn't look like fun. Stuffs the takedown there. How good is his takedown defense? Yamago Medoff gets touched by that kick there. Big shots being landed on both sides here. Man, he has a great double leg. My goodness, he has a, a great double leg. And now is where things could get really interesting. Oh, great job by him there to reverse things and get the dominant position. Khabib's back in half guard. He's very comfortable here. Side control now, DC. A lot of options at his disposal from here. Moving his head pretty well defensively on the ground here. Beautiful transition. Now inside the closed guard. And he's gonna try to find ways to pass and move to a submission. Excellent ground and pound strikes here by Nermago Meta. Getting the ball here. He's gotta be careful here. Posture's up. Oh, and he lands a brutal strike to the head. Oh, nice elbow. And there it is, another strike on the ground gets through. Nice movement to avoid some of those strikes from the top. Mako Medoff, ground and pound from half goal. Oh, he's attacking choke now. Well, it looks like that Doris is tight. He gets out. That is great submission defense, keeping everything short and not allowing his opponent to get the submission victory. Pretty good work with the ground and pound here by Pede. Now drops inside that close guard, DC. Full guard. Let's see how patient he is as he attacks a submission or a big ground and pound. And now he's got the back. Full mount now. Oh, big shots from the top. These ground strikes are starting to add up. Oh, trying to pass here, but Dikembe Mutombo style. He gets denied. Block! Great job, Block. Gets to the single call of time. All right, well, good news is he rocked him. Bad news is he wasn't able to finish the job, and now his opponent's back in the fight. I mean, you don't get those opportunities very often. You got to take full advantage of them when they're presented to you. Champ, look at that redness underneath his elbow. A lot of those strikes to the body start to pile up. Getting beat up and being smart enough to not be headhunting the entire time. I like this. I like this approach. Nice kick. These guys are going at it. Oh, counters with a straight right hand. That'll work. Stuffs the takedown. No problem. Good exchange there inside. All right, so now blood is a factor. You see that he has been opened up in that eye area. Yeah, he's got hit in the eye and not only the cut, but he's nothing to worry about too much now. But he's got to be very careful with it as we go forward. Great punch landed with so much power. Oh, my God. All right, heading back to the corner now, and Nermago Medov's corner now. We'll take a look at that lip. The cut man is in, and you got to tighten that up. It's really starting to bleed now. We'll see if uh, it rears its ugly head as this fight continues. All right, so there's the horn signifying the end of the round. We had a knockdown there, but not a knockout. No, it wasn't a knockout, but you can't take those shots. 
That big punch landed, and it sat him down. If he gets hit with another one of those, it might be good night, Irene. You ready to fight? Ready. Second round underway. So he's got the ground and pound game going here. All right, so the hands are crispy tonight. Not exactly what we thought we would see out of this wrestler, but as a former two-time U.S. Olympian yourself with some hands, <laughs> takes his back now. Good movement by him here, transitioning very well on the ground too. Step for step, he's staying with his opponent in every transition. Khabib's back in full metal. All right, so he lands again, just like we saw in the last round, realizing a lot of success with his more time. You know why change it? It's working, and it's working from the very start of the fight. The moment this fight started, you saw the advantage that we predicted was there. He started to take advantage of it early, and now he's continued to build on that. This kickboxer looks amazing right The ground strikes continue to pile up. Ramako Manoff's looking for that arm triangle now. Oh, he's got it locked in. He's got that arm triangle deep. Yeah, Paige and Alexio let it. Somehow he got out though. Great job clearing the hips. Facing and getting out of that Ezekiel Chokotek. Nicely done there as he forces the miss from his opponent. He's got to be careful here. Well, he's avoided a lot of the damage here on the ground. Nicely done with the head movement there. Not staying still underneath his opponent is allowing him to not get hit with anything too damaging. Beautiful ground strikes landing. Again, not much defense there. Another ground strike gets through. Oh, he postures up in a big head strike by Nermago Meta. Just over two minutes now to go. Well, as usual, suffocating work from the top here by Nermago Meta. Another ground and pound strike gets home. He's got to start throwing down. Standing over his opponent here and making these strikes count. Beautiful sequence there by Nermago Meta. Look at that, going to the arm bar. Ooh, that looks wicked tight. It's getting tight now. Oh. It's advancing. There's the tap. You win by submission. Wow. What a moment for this fighter here tonight. Called his shot. Gets the win by way of submission. That after party is going to be on fire. He got to his position. He found the submission. He squeezed and got it done. It was amazing to watch, and it was amazing to be a part of the broadcast for such an amazing performance. All right, let's take a look back at the replay as he gets it done by submission tonight, champ. He does a great job of staying patient. He doesn't rush or panic. You are never safe when you're fighting this guy. You're in a lot of trouble. You're in a lot of trouble the entire time when you're this good in the submission. Let's go inside the octagon to Bruce Buffett. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean is going to stop to this contest at three minutes, 17 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by tap out due to an arm bar. And new undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world, Habib the Eagle.
All right, so Khabib Nurmagomedov had a lot of submissions late in his UFC title run. He gets another one here tonight, and when you get to the ground with this guy, caution flammable. Absolutely. I mean, he's one of those guys that really can dominate you if you aren't careful. And that's exactly what he showed tonight. He gets to his positions. He makes you grapple on his terms. And he does a good job of really controlling his opponents. You make a mistake, this guy will take your neck and he will choke you out. And he told us respectfully in the fighter meeting he saw a huge...